Hi everyone, I'm Annie TP and welcome back to my Kirby Superstar walkthrough. In this part, uh, I will be fighting bosses, or one boss at least. But first a cutscene. Are you? You gotta be kidding. I'll be a minute. I'm gonna kill myself. Okay. Wow. Wow. Ooh, that was cool. How you do that, you should teach me. Wanting to control pop star is kind of dumb. It's probably not much anyway. How can controlling pop star enable you to do anything? That's I don't know. Mark's logic, I guess. So with the I should stop talking. I really did ruin, ruin that cutscene, didn't I? Yeah, I'm sorry about that. I got a phone call and my talking kind of destroyed the feeling. Anyways, Marx is gonna go off and engage in a push of war with the sun and moon. So, yeah, uh, you're going to want to enter Marx, which sounds kind of weird. But you can actually do that. So, uh, you should do it. Just do it. Okay, man? Just do it. I know you can do it. Anyways, this is... Wow. Uh, this is Mr. Nova's core. I... Uh, how do I dodge all this? Okay. Uh, don't hit the walls. Don't hit the enemies. Don't hit the red balls. Don't touch anything. Like, except... I mean, yeah, I'm probably gonna die here, but uh, probably gonna have to take a couple of tries because I'm terrible at this boss for some reason. Yeah, there's no way, no way. I'll explain how the boss works though. This is the Heart of Nova, the second last boss in Milky Way Wishes. And the way you defeat is by hitting these little moving things. And it starts to move really fast. And there's one, there's one part that I just can't dodge for some reason. I don't even, I don't even know if it's possible, but I'm gonna die here. I can guarantee you that. Cause it's, there's such a small space for you to get in, and that wasn't even the one, but I died there anyway. The upside to dying is that you come back with full health, which is nice, because otherwise I'd be dying all over the place. I don't know why I said out there, but yeah, there it is. The thing about this boss is that it's really easy to take a huge amount of damage in a very short time. Like, as you saw in the first part of the boss, I just lost half my health from that little thing touching me. And that can be very annoying, especially when you're doing really well. Uh, anyways, I think I've decided to split this boss into two parts. And just to make the video shorter, I think I kind of left it on a cliffhanger there. So, uh, yeah, I will see you in the next part, which probably won't be as... It's... I don't know. I don't know anything, so uh, I'll see you in the next part.